Hello and welcome back to Shakespeare. We are working on the sonnets and today we've got sonnet number 25, which is sort of another love sonnet, but yeah, let's get into it. Sonnet 25 goes, let those who are in favor with their stars of public honor and proud titles boast, whilst I, <laughs> whom fortune of such triumph bars unlooked for, joy in that I honor most. Great princes' favorites, their fair leaves spread but as the marigold at the sun's eye, and in themselves their pride lies buried, for at a frown they in their glory die. The painful warrior, famous for fight, after a thousand victories, once foiled, is from the book of honor raised quite, and all the rest forgot for which he toiled. Then happy I that love and am beloved, where I may not remove nor be removed. So the way that I took this before I started reading some of the other analyses about it was that this is, it's talking about fame and importance and, and in the previous sonnets he talked a little bit about, you know, the, keeping the love secret or, or knowing that the love is just mine for the fair youth, not knowing how the fair youth feels about me, but it's so strong and all-consuming. This is a little bit of a celebration of that and a celebration of the fact that the love is something that Shakespeare gets to keep just for himself. He spends the first bit of the play talking about people who are famous, people who are favored in the court, you know, kings and dukes and, and people with, with lots of power and saying they can keep their titles, they can boast about all that stuff. I'm going to thrill in the secret of my love for this fair youth, this thing that I honor most. I'm going to take joy from that. And that's a good thing because princes can fall out of favor really fast. You know, government officials can fall out of favor really fast. Take take the famous war heroes who win a thousand battles, but as soon as they are cut down and lose a battle and die, they're basically erased from the history books and all the great stuff that they did is forgotten about. And then Shakespeare concludes the play by saying, you know, this is kind of awesome that I love and am loved in such a circumstance where that's not going to happen, where it's going to continue on, where the love will remain, where you're not going to fall for my favor, I'm not going to fall for your favor, it's not in the public eye, any of that sort of stuff. So it's it's kind of sweet in that respect. Like, yes, the majority of the poem is focused on others and the fleeting nature of, of fame and power, but there is sort of a lovely, you know, I get to just have this little thing and I'm just gonna be happy and content having this little thing and this little thing is the love that we share. So that is sonnet number 25. Come on back tomorrow for sonnet 26. I'll see you then. Mwah.